Cheryl Cooper. I have been on the faculty at UT Tyler for about nine years. Prior to that, I worked in public health and community health as a nurse. Um, my master's degree is in nursing, and I have an undergraduate degree in anthropology. Um, my doctorate is in health studies, health sciences from Texas Women's University. Um, my research interest is culture and health and I do work um, internationally from time to time in Africa and in Guatemala and um, I am interested primarily in health and culture and I'm a qualitative health researcher. In the Master's in Health Sciences program, uh, we have uh, a variety of health-oriented courses. Uh, there's a course in research design. There's also a course in ep epidemiology, in behavioral health, in uh, global health. And then there are many electives that students can actually choose electives based on their interest. Uh, we are very uh, individual oriented with students, so we like to know what their long-term career goals are, uh, what they dream of doing in the future, and we try to help them to design the program, to design their courses actually, based on those interests and what they'd like to be doing, say, five years from now or ten years from now. The one strength, I think, of our program is that we do uh, help the students to design their own um, their their own coursework to some degree uh, in terms of what their future career goals are. We like to help them to think ahead as to what they might like to be doing later on and help them to um, take the courses, especially the elective courses, that will uh, serve them well in a future career. And I think that is a, a strength of our program. All our graduate students have a choice um, as to whether to do an internship or to do a thesis. We encourage a thesis. Uh, students are usually a little bit frightened of that at first, but we help them to prepare for that. If they choose to um, do an internship, a, a practicum, and we sometimes call it a field experience, then they choose, um, based on their future career plans, their interests, they choose a site that could be an international site. They could go to another country to do their internship. Um, they could do something locally, working in community, which many of our students have done. Um, they can do um, various, if they're interested, for example, in occupational health or in uh, programs in um, uh, industry, for example, industrial health, then they can go choose to perhaps do an internship in that area. So uh, there's a lot of choice for them. Our requirements in terms of uh, educational background are very uh, broad. Uh, we do look most closely though at their, the student's experience in uh, the health field, if they come in and have already worked in the health field uh, but perhaps have not had a strong health background, we help them to build on that in our program. Um, most of many of our students are biology majors many of them are interested in going to medical school eventually may not be quite ready to apply yet but want some a stronger background in health before they apply um, we also have many students who have degrees in social sciences sociology uh, we also have students or we are interested in students with a journalism background because we know that there is a good career uh, possibility for health journalism and so we are very open to students who have perhaps some science, a fairly strong science background but also um, are in the communication field and especially in journalism. So we are in nutrition as well. Uh, we have students who are who have come into our program who are registered dietitians or uh, have majored in nutrition. Uh, for students who may not um, 
have the background or the academic qualifications at a particular point to enter into our program, we will try to mentor them to get ready. Uh, for example, if they've not had uh, anatomy and physiology, for example, or enough biology, to prepare them for our graduate courses, then we do offer, uh, our faculty do mentor them to help them prepare and get ready to come into the program.